Hi everyone, I'm Sean. I'm filming uh, from uh, Rione Sanita. This video is going to be about street art and uh, it's uh, basically a work in progress. I'm at uh, Rione Sanita along Via Sanita just before it becomes uh, Via Fontanelle. So the direction is uh, from Rione Sanita towards uh, the cemetery of uh, Fontanelle for those uh, who know their whereabouts in Naples. And uh, this is uh, the work in progress that I wanted to show you. There's uh, a picture of uh, a monkey surrounded by uh, leaves and uh, a graffiti that says uh, one planet. So far it looks uh, just like a throw up with the uh, two basic colors, uh, just uh, black and white. But uh, we can see that the work is uh, going to progress uh, into something uh, much more complex and extensive. The artist uh, executing the work is uh, German. I'll be able to tell you his name uh, in the next few days. The other end of uh, the wall uh, finishes uh, in uh, the head of a tiger. Now, obviously we don't know if it's a Bengali tiger, a Siberian tiger, but it's a tiger. However, this wall is quite stratified and quite layered. So on the right hand side uh, of uh, the tiger head, uh, you can just about make out the reading De Napoli and Bruscolotti, two former Naples team players. And uh, at the base of the head, uh, somewhat in the shadow, you can read the 1986, uh, 1987, 1988, which are the dates for the first uh, championship won uh, by Naples team. So uh, an older graffiti celebrating Naples team is now covered by a new mural. Just under the tiger there is a, a stencil uh, or a, a poster dedicated to uh, Diego Maradona so it says uh, Santo Diego, Saint Diego and uh, written uh, in blue just above it uh, on the broken plaster I can just about read or guess Roma Merda which means the Rome team is shit. And next door from the tiger, there is uh, the much celebrated uh, black and white uh, piece uh, by Bosoletti, The Hidden Hope, uh, Speranza Nascosta. At the entrance of uh, Vatenda, which is a voluntary organization and uh, used to be uh, locally quite famous uh, as a rehab center. So tomorrow I'll be able to show you how uh, the work has progressed. Goodbye. Hi guys, uh, I'm back on the street art scene uh, the day after uh, the graffiti and uh, murals uh, started. Uh, I'm uh, personally ready to uh, go on a bike tour, but uh, anyways, uh, we're gonna have a look at uh, the work in progress. So this is uh, the work that was uh, done yesterday. We have um, the monkey that has uh, further developed into uh, skills uh, in the direction of the cemetery of uh, Fontanelle but uh, also as in an omen for the future meaning that if we carry on uh, polluting the planet at this rate uh, this is uh, the fate awaiting us the writing one planet with a halo on top of letter N has progressed uh, and uh, there's uh, the obvious uh, symbol of uh, time passing by. Just underneath uh, there is uh, another skull, so another bad omen. And the writing, one future. So we're basically all on the same planet uh, and there is uh, just uh, one future awaiting us. Let's not spoil it. So uh, the German artists uh, declined to have an interview because uh, they are actually working uh, for uh, One Planet, One Future, which I discovered is a, a foundation based uh, in Milan. And they try and um, collect donations uh, basically to save uh, the environment, to save uh, endangered uh, species or uh, places of uh, great natural beauty. However, uh, the artist uh, is uh, definitely the real deal. He's uh, from Germany. We won't say his name, but uh, he's uh, really passionate about uh, what is now called the street art and what he grew up with as a graffiti. So he considers himself uh, an old school uh, graffiti artist who also does murals. 
and uh, he grew up uh, in the hip hop uh, sorry in the hip hop uh, culture of the time so including uh, hip hop uh, dancing uh, skateboard uh, uh, rap and uh, of course uh, the graffiti artist so the whole deal and um, he loves the city of Naples uh, he was uh, here on uh, numerous occasions uh, in the past and he caught up with uh, locally famous artists uh, such as uh, Kaf and Sharp and Zen uh, he also met them uh, recently and uh, let's hope uh, we can see more of his work According uh, to him, uh, the city has not changed uh, so much. So Naples is uh, one of those places, uh, a little bit like Barcelona, where it's uh, really easy to produce uh, street art because uh, there's no one there to stop you. There's no one there to say, hey, uh, you're doing something terrible, but uh, people actually encourage your work. And um, what has changed, however, is that the City Council of Naples has been collaborating with street artists and uh, giving them uh, walls of the city to decorate. So that's just uh, great. One Planet, One Future has uh, literally become my daily routine. We have uh, some more writing that's been uh, inserted in the word one. And it's uh, Il nostro unico pianeta, pianeta azzurro. And uh, that means uh, our planet is uh, just one, it's unique, uh, it's uh, the blue planet. And under we have uh, the writing in English, uh, choose Earth. The next uh, slogan uh, on the right hand side of the wasp is Basta la plastica, we've had enough of plastic. Just by the bus stop we have the writing uh, climate refugees and amo l'oceano, I love the ocean. Here we have uh, Be the Ocean Keeper, Una Sola Storia, just uh, one uh, history, and then a mix of Italian and English, Scegli la Terra, Choose Earth, and uh, underneath in English, A Sea of Plastic. The word uh, future, we have uh, One Ocean, and uh, 10 years left, Diventa un protettore, Become a Defender. And if you don't, the tiger will bite you. Hi everybody, this is the last part of a video about uh, One Planet, One Future. We have a group of kids here and uh, two uh, uh, leaders or educators uh, teaching them about the project through interviews. And uh, the piece is uh, finally complete. The new significant uh, addition to the piece is that some writing has been added uh, celebrating uh, Naples uh, team uh, championship victory from 1986-1987 uh, so we have uh, um, Napoli Campione d'Italia a crown with the Italian flag and we have uh, all the names of uh, football players of that legendary team including uh, Garella, Bruscolotti, Ferrara, Maradona, Carnevale so lots and lots of uh, Neapolitans uh, know the names uh, by heart still now after 30 years and uh, many, many children are also called Diego in honor of Maradona. So this is the piece complete and this is goodbye.